Now a very simple recipe for the health conscious. It's a Chinese dessert. They don't generally eat much dessert in China, but we have covered a lot of them on this channel, haven't we? You'll find this in all good restaurants and quite a few crappy ones. It is deep fried steamed bread. Mm, I don't know a better name for it, but I did kind of describe the entire process in the name. You're going to need some oil, which you'll get hot, to deep fry the steamed bread. That oil looks like water a little bit. Don't use water. These are the steamed breads that we have another video about if you want to go and check that out. I'll put a link at the end if I remember. It's just a very traditional Chinese bread, very popular in the north of China, but eaten pretty much throughout these days. Oh, she's going to make it pretty by cutting some crosses in, some X's, tens if you will. You're going to need a really blunt knife to annoy people on the internet. And do it like so, thusly. Mind your fingers. In fact, this is probably not a dish you want to make around small children. The urge to stab them with that knife may overcome you. Also, there's hot oil. Be very careful with hot oil. It always freaks me out, honestly. I get freaked out daily. When the oil's fairly warm, not super hot, put in your steamed bread like so. Whoa, gosh, what did I just say? Be careful with that. Did I just say be careful? Okay. You probably don't have to endlessly touch them, but this is her style. You might know that by now. Touch, 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 touch. What about that one over on the right hand side that she hasn't really touched? Is it getting cooked worse? You could probably, mm, I don't know. Hey, you see that big sort of cancerous lump on one of them? It's not actually cancer. Bread can't get cancer. It's because our steamer has big holes in it like that. It's just the way that it was made. Anyway. That's cooking along nicely. You could call these Chinese hot cross buns and eat them at Easter time. The whole time I was living in China, I never remembered Easter. They just don't do it. I always got to like June and be like, wait a minute, where's Easter? We should have had some of these. You can't buy chocolate eggs. So we could have made these. Not that I'm Christian, I'm not. But I do like hot cross buns. And these are nothing like them. That oil's getting hotter and hotter, as you can see. You don't want it to be too hot. She actually turns off the heat right now because that oil's gonna retain a lot of the heat. And she's only making this many. If you're making more, don't turn the heat off now. It's starting to look pretty good, huh? Didn't take very long. The whole video is pretty much as long as the video. Wait, the whole cooking process is pretty easy. Busy, 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 busy. Okay, almost ready to take out and shove in my face or yours just keep hassling them hassle hassle how long was that not even a couple of minutes ready to take out might be an idea to put them on something like this so that more oil can drop off before you put it onto your plate there we go don't try to put too many of the spoon that would be stupid that's enough isn't it that's enough that's a beautiful plate, isn't it? I borrowed that from the staff room at work and I'm planning on giving it back one day. It's just that it's more beautiful than all the plates that we have. I don't feel good about taking it. I just had to take it because I wanted to take some cake home. And I did. Wow, look at that. So I suppose you're thinking, hey, how can this be a dessert when it's not sweet? A can of condensed milk? That doesn't sound like a good idea, but it actually works pretty well. These are affectionately known in Japan as bukaki cakes. Actually, that's not true. They probably have different cakes that are really called bukkake cakes and... Hmm, probably don't want to... I don't know. I'm full anyway. Put the condensed milk all over it. And they are ready to eat. Eat them while they're hot because they'll be a little bit crunchy. And they will be soft in the middle. It's like It'd be like eating a crunchy cloud. All sort of crunchy on the outside and then creamy on the interior. Yeah, can't bring myself to smash it. So... Wow, just like a cloud. Just in case it hasn't been punished enough, punch it on the head a few times. And nom 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 nom. After she had that mouthful, I ended up eating all of them in one go, and they were delicious. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye-bye. Mm. Bye-bye.